Over the last week, there have been new developments relating to COVID-19. For us in St. Lucia, we continue to note increasing cases and deaths. There have been reports of outbreaks at our healthcare institutions. This situation is of concern to all of us. Since the first reported case of COVID-19, we continue to see our frontline workers, such as firemen, police, and healthcare workers being affected by the virus. Healthcare personnel continue to be on the front line of the nation's fight against COVID-19. By providing critical care to those who are or might be infected, they are at increased risk of infection. Therefore, frontline workers are encouraged to get vaccinated. The significant increase in reported cases over the past two weeks indicates active transmission of the virus in the population. To maximize protection from the virus, and particularly the Delta variant, and possible transmission to others in close contact, an appeal goes out to get vaccinated. To date, 15.6% of the population is fully vaccinated. This accounts for 28,312 persons having received both doses of the vaccine. It is important that we achieve high COVID-19 vaccination coverage sooner than later. Lives and livelihoods will be saved, hospitalizations and deaths reduced. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs appeals to persons living with underlying chronic conditions such as heart disease, diabetes, hypertension, to take all necessary measures in protecting their health in addition to getting vaccinated. COVID-19 infection significantly increases the risk of complications and death. Over the past few days, we have noted fully vaccinated persons with comorbid conditions being hospitalized with severe disease and unfavorable outcomes. Both vaccines available here are safe and effective. Increased vaccination coverage is valuable to ensuring immunity of the population. In this regard, we encourage persons to access a vaccination site to get vaccinated. Our focus is on getting more people vaccinated at the soonest. For persons who are due for their second dose, they are encouraged to do so. One dose will offer some protection. Completing the vaccine series and getting both doses of the vaccine regime is the best way to ensure full protection against COVID-19. Additionally, it is important to keep your scheduled appointments. As more contagious variants circulate, everyone is encouraged to play their part in ensuring that we reach our ultimate goal. COVID-19 vaccination update will be provided in the coming week. <music>